Hey, what is up you guys? It's Audrey and welcome back to my channel. If you are new, bonjour and welcome. Today's video, I'm going to show you and kind of talk through how I break in my suffix point shoes. Um, yeah, so right here, I'm just breaking in the box. If you watched my last video, I said that I have to really just smash and really just bend in my boxes because of my Taylor's bunions and just to make them more comfortable for me. So that is just what I'm doing. I just press them with my hands. I know a lot of people hammer them, smash them in the door, like bang them, but I don't want them like completely dead, like all over. I just really want the sides of the shoe to be pretty soft and um, comfortable, so... Yeah, now I'm just um, breaking in my shank a bit with my hand. This is kind of me getting my shoes ready for a performance, like a show. So I'm not going to take a whole lot of time to break them in just in class, especially because this day we had partnering. So I didn't really think I was going to have a chance to break them in. So I'm just bending them a bit. You can kind of see what I'm doing. I kind of bend them both ways to get that three quarter and then also just... Um, the shank and I don't do anything special I just bend them right in the middle and I love how it is it really shapes my arch nicely but I mean try whatever you want but it really depends on your feet where you should break in your shank um, I know some people do it differently you can just see what I'm doing right here though now I'm just gonna put my shoes on and kind of move around in them I really don't actually do a lot to break in my shoes these are a pretty easy shoe to break in suffix stellars um, they're not a super hard shoe, and they're not super soft, so I really love them. Um, yeah, and also, I'm, I don't know if you guys have seen how I tie my shoes. I know everyone ties their ribbons differently. Um, so here's a bit of how I do mine. This is just how I learned it. I feel like every studio ever has some weird, new, different way to do it. But also, I'm just kind of bending over the shoe there, just trying them on. And before I tie them, I'm just kind of pressing around on that three quarter as you can obviously see um yeah just making sure seeing if i need to break them in a bit more um these shoes yeah i was only going to be able to wear them today was my only day to kind of break them in and i think i was gonna well i am gonna plan on wearing these for our first nutcracker performance so this kind of like my perfect shoe i'm just trying to make pretty well so yeah now i'm finally tying them here's me tying my ribbons um so i just cross around go over like twice and then i tie right in the middle a little knot and i, I tuck them in um in the top i don't show me doing that because i, I just didn't because i'm just i'm not trying to make them look pretty or anything but i do tuck in my little knots so now i'm just kind of pressing around walking around on my three quarter to make sure that three quarters broken in because especially if we're running around on stage we really want to make sure that that's ready and then just doing some prances um it's really the main thing that i do in my shoes is just make sure that i can move around in them and yeah now i'm just messing around this i really don't do a lot to break my shoes in this is a really easy shoe to break in, so it's really, really awesome and helpful. So yeah, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're new to my channel, make sure to subscribe right down below. Give this video a big thumbs up so we can all be pals, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys. <laughs>